Hi, my name is Megan and I'm on the nutrition team at the North Texas Food Bank. Today we're going to be making an easy seafood pasta. All the ingredients in this dish can be found from our family box. Our family boxes are distributed through our mobile pantry distributions as well as our partner agencies. So this dish only has four ingredients in it. We have elbow macaroni, canned clam chowder, turnip greens, and corn. The spices I'll be using are cayenne pepper, black pepper, and garlic powder, but feel free to use whatever spices and herbs that you like in this dish. Now that we have all the ingredients, let's start cooking. First, we're going to lightly salt our pasta water and wait for the water to come to a rolling boil. When it does, go ahead and add half of the box of pasta. Cook the pasta according to the package directions, about five to seven minutes. Save some of the pasta water to make the pasta sauce more flavorful. Strain the rest of the pasta and add the pasta back into the pot. Turn down your heat to a medium low. Add the canned clam chowder to the pasta. Next, add the pasta water. Stir until combined. Add your corn and turnip greens. Make sure all ingredients are combined well. Add spices of your choice. Here I'm using black pepper, cayenne pepper, and garlic powder. Stir until all ingredients are combined and warm. All right, there we have it, our easy seafood pasta. Only four ingredients along with some spices. Easy, quick to make, and a good way to use that canned clam chowder. And here to test the recipe is my husband, Wade. So here we got the seafood Whoa. pasta. Tell us how it is. It smells good. Tastes good. Consistent flavor. A few spices in there. It's not an overly seafood taste though. So I think it's really good. What do you yeah. add? Yeah, I would add more spices. Mm -hmm. I like spicy. Mm -hmm. Ooh, onions might be good. Yeah. Thanks, Wade. I'm gonna take it. Okay. <laughs> so hopefully you can make this dish at home and make use of that canned clam chowder during the summer. If you want to add any chicken or chickpeas to it or different herbs and spices, feel free to do so to make it how you'd like it. If you want more recipes or cooking demonstrations, please go to our website at ntfb.org.